and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be on how I get this kind of glossy faded out popsicle lips look that I like to do a lot. It's something that I think is really cute and trendy for spring and summer and I think it pairs wonderfully for like um, glass skin like I'm wearing today and just a simple eye look. So if you want to see how I get these popsicle lips then keep on watching. So the first product that you're going to need is you're going to need to start out with your lips being hydrated so while you do your face makeup, eye makeup and everything make sure you're wearing a lip balm. I wore this Jack Black Intense Therapy lip balm. I think this brand is actually targeted at men but my husband has this and I stole it because I like it. The products that you're going to need are whatever color you want your popsicle to be that you just ate a lot of air quotes here, but um, I'm going for kind of like a orangey, warm toned um, red, kind of like a cherry popsicle. Something that'll go with my cheeks. I did that really sunburnt look today with this glass skin look, so I think that um, like a cherry popsicle type look would really flatter the look I got going on with my face. I'm taking my ColourPop Just a Tint Lip Crayon in the shade Chimichanga. The next product you're going to need is a very sheer, like, see-through lip gloss, either a clear one or something with a slight tint. The one I usually reach for is the Lime Crime Wet Cherry Lip Gloss. It's a clear gloss, but since I always use this one for a look like this, mine looks like it has a little bit of pink because of the doe foot touching my lips. Another one that's good is this Lime Crime Wet Cherry Lip Gloss in the shade Cherry Crush. It looks very orange, but the, it just has that slight orange tint. It's not really an orange gloss, it just gives that like peachy, sheared out orange look to your lips. Today what I'm going to do is I'm going to take Chimichanga with Cherry Crush. The reason I like using a gloss instead of just taking this and fading it out with a nude lip is because I like the wet look it gives, like you literally just finished eating a popsicle. So I'm going to take this little crayon and I'm just going to rim the center of my lips, just here, right in the middle. and then smack your lips together. If you need more pigment, keep adding it. Don't go on with something super opaque just at once. Build it up slowly. Now you can see it just stained the center of my mouth like I just finished eating a popsicle. You could stop there. It's a cute little look, but I like to add the gloss. Go over with whatever transparent lip gloss you have. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit more. As you can see, the color is focused right in the center, but it doesn't look very harsh or anything. It just kind of fades out, like you literally just finished eating a popsicle in the summertime. Thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video and you enjoy content like this, then please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. If you want to find me elsewhere online, my Instagram is Victoria Brianna with one N. And yeah, I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys!